This video shows how you can configure the data finder. The configuration of data finder includes search area, data plugins, file extensions, indexer, and other settings. On the search areas tab, you can select the folders in which data finder finds the files you want to index. More details are covered in a separate video. The Data Plugins tab shows which data plugins are installed. Here you can enable or disable data plugins and re-index all files of a specific data plugin. The File Extensions tab lists the file extensions of all files for which a data plugin is installed. If multiple data plugins exist for a file extension, such as CSV or DAT, you can determine the order of the data plugins for the indexing process. On the Indexer tab, you define timeouts and an indexing schedule. A distinction is made between automatic and manual indexing. For manual indexing, a file tells the data finder which files to index. However, the default is automatic indexing. Here Data Finder automatically recognizes when a file has been added, deleted, or modified. The idle time defines the length of time neither keyboard nor mouse may be used before an indexing process starts. This is a helpful setting when many files need to be indexed, because indexing affects the processing speed when working interactively. To prevent indexing from being interrupted for an unnecessarily long time, if you have an erroneous file or data plugin, you can set a timeout for the maximum indexing duration of a file. As additional indexing security, you can specify an indexing schedule. This determines when to execute a check of all directories in the search area. If the scan finds a difference between the contents of the directories and the data finder database, the corresponding file will be re-indexed. You can also trigger this process manually with, start now. On the, advanced, tab you can define the directory for the data finder index and two additional timeouts. You can save and load the configuration settings of my data finder. In data finder you can optimize frequently used properties. This later increases the access speed when searching for these properties. Here you can optimize the properties for each of the three levels file, channel group, and channel. For optimized properties, Data Finder displays a new button in the search input area, which shows a list of all occurring values for this property. This allows you to select the values of a property you want to search for, and help you avoid making mistakes. One more note. If there are a lot of properties, the data finder index can become quite large. Optimizing properties significantly increases the index of the data finder. Therefore, we recommend to optimize only the most important and most frequently used properties. Please also have a look at the other videos on topics related to Diadem and Data Finder. And Carpe Diadem.